mobile dentistry on the move, new dangers of e-cigarettes, and more. I'm Allie Cook for the Dental News Network. It's April 23rd, 2014, and this is your Wednesday Watch. Here's today's dental news. Poisoning from electronic cigarettes and their nicotine liquid is on the rise, according to the CDC. It's reported that e-cigarettes now account for almost 42% of all cigarette-related poison complaint calls, and more than half of the calls related to the nicotine vaporizing devices reported negative health effects. This is actually a higher proportion than calls related to conventional cigarettes. The most common complaints were vomiting, nausea, and eye irritation, but there was one suicide death from intravenous injection of the nicotine liquid. A statement from the American Heart Association calls the new data disturbing and has called out for monitoring of these devices by the FDA. Mobile dentistry is literally on the move. Here at the Wednesday Watch, we told you recently about a New York City dentist who began making house calls to elderly patients and patients with mobility issues. Now, mobile dentistry is making headlines in three other regions. In Michigan, Governor Rick Snyder has signed a law that he believes will increase the standards of care for mobile dentistry. The law requires mobile dental units to obtain permits from the Department of Community Health. It also gives the department more authority to oversee them. In Washington State, one dentist spends half of her week in a clinic and the other half on the move, going to see patients who may not be able to go out to see her. Pennsylvania has also seen an increase in mobile dental clinics, traveling thousands of miles to provide care to residents. Coming up, a new line of precision hand pieces and an endodontic solution for your practice. Psycan's new line of Sanal Precision hand pieces are balanced to relieve wrist strain, miniaturized for maneuverability, and equipped with glass rod fiber optics to illuminate the oral cavity. Psycan's hygiene protection system is incorporated into each hand piece, which has a resin filling to close the gap between the hand piece's outer and inner sleeves, preventing debris buildup. Acteon North America's new Endo Center offers both reciprocating and rotary modes of operation. The different modes provide endodontic motor compatibility with any manufacturer's rotary file system, offering versatility for the user. The endodontic motor has the ability to customize up to 10 preset programs and has settings for six different E-type contra-angle ratios, providing a wide array of options for any practice. Thanks for checking out the Wednesday Watch. We'll see you next week with more from Dentistry Today and DNN.